Hello again, News Plus Notes readers. We're here on the apron with Staff Sergeant Sturgeon, or Fish. <laughs> Obviously, that wasn't a very much of a reach for a nickname. No, it was not. So these pilots really couldn't do a thing without you, can they? No, we, uh, they, trust, they put much faith in us to get these jets ready for them every day, um, getting everything set up, uh, whether it's just for a training mission to do the show or do a media flight, uh, anything from maintenance to anything they need to get the flight and the mission done. Well, there's so much involved in this, and the pilots get all the glory. But, you know, there's 28 different crew types in the, in the um, Thunderbirds demonstration team. And it's just a mind-boggling to me to see the precision and how you guys go, even though things was a little bit messed up today with the delay and all. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, we're just kind of the heroes behind the scene. You know, we don't need to be out front to take credit or anything. We, you know, we love what we do. Uh, that's why we're here. And, you know, we're happy to do it. So what's the most difficult thing to keep in repair on a Thunderbird? Uh, I don't know. I don't know what the most, probably the most difficult thing is just the timeline. You know, we have a tight timeline to keep these jets going. Uh, the maintenance is pretty simple. We're all, you know, pretty knowledgeable uh, on maintaining these things. The F-16 has been around for a very long time. Uh, but uh, I just say it's the timeline. You know, we got a tight timeline to work with to get them to go, get them going. Um, other than that, it's pretty easy, you know. Do you keep, like, all the spare parts you think you're going to need on the plane? Absolutely. We have a Connex that we uh, travel with that comes with us, travels on the C-17 with us, uh, and we have a line trailer that has uh, tools and parts. Um, if we Every now and then we have to overnight something if it's something that's kind of unusual. But all our standard uh, stuff that tends to fail, uh, we take with us, absolutely. How much extra time does it take to clean up the tail on the slot plane? Uh, not, not that much time. Uh, it's not like the old days where they used to paint the tails black uh, because of all the, the soot and everything, or the exhaust from the boss's jet. Um, uh, we clean them you know, daily before the show. It doesn't take too much time, you know, 10, 15 minutes up there. But you know, with the white tail, you can see it doesn't show that much. Well, thank you so much for your service, and congratulations on being one of the elite maintenance technicians in the United States Air Force. Oh, my pleasure. Thank you.